Okay, so let's take a look at uh, some of these financial literacy questions here. Start with question number two. It says to calculate the time it would take for a $7,000 investment to earn $1,400 of simple interest at a rate of 4% per annum. So when we're looking for time in these questions, um, the time is usually related to how they quote the interest rate. And interest rates um, in most financial um, questions are always given as a, um, a rate per annum or a rate per year. So if the interest rate is being quoted per year, in this case, or per annum, that means the time value that we're going to be calculating will end up being in years. Okay, and then if the question, if there's a further um, conversion that needs to be done, um, we can do it from there. So we'll just set this up. So the easiest way to do this is you write down the equation for simple interest. So capital I for interest is equal to principal um, times the rate times time. So usually I equals PRT. Okay, and then you can, you can just make a list of values um, or just fill them in as you go along. Um, if it's a fairly straightforward question. Um, so the principal here is $7,000. Okay, so we'll just put that in as 7,000. The rate is given to us as 4% per annum. So the thing you need to remember to do in a question like this is you always have to convert the rate to its decimal equivalent. Um, and it's, again, it's being quoted as a yearly rate. So it's 0 0.04. So don't just put it in as four. Um, and then the time is what we're being asked to solve for, so that's T. And it does tell us that the interest that we are going to earn is going to be a $1,400 in terms of value. So that's what I is equal to. So in a question like this, <clears throat> all we're simply doing here is just multiplying it through and then solving for T. So 7,000 times uh, 0 0.04 should be, whoops, sorry about that, should be about 200 and 80 times t and then we have 1400 okay so it just becomes a simple algebra question um, you need to isolate t and and calculate what it is so we're going to divide 280 into both sides here okay and t is going to be equal to 1400 divided by 280 um, which is 140 divided by 28 and I think it comes out to be 5.0, so it's actually equal to five. So the time value is equal to five, but because the time here is quoted like per annum, or sorry, the interest rate was quoted per annum, the time by default is going to be in years. Okay, so we will just say um, T here is equal to five years in terms of that, that question. Okay, so that's a simple way to just work through question two. Um, again, uh, all you're really looking here to do is isolate T, but the, the catch in, in these questions is to make sure that you understand the rate of percent in terms for the value um, being earned is usually quoted as a per annum or per yearly basis. And it should be fairly clear in the question um, when, you, when you take a look at it.